Hey Judy, are you there? It's me, Pat. Uh, we had an adventure today. I never have an adventure. You're gonna, I don't know how I'm gonna edit this in, so we'll figure it out, but. Let's fly my five inch flow ride. And I was doing some kind of juicy flick looking thing near the ground and I, when I finished off and I was drifting backwards, I was not going quite the direction I expected. And I started seeing leaves on both sides of the camera, and I'm like, oh, shirt. And yeah, I got, uh, I was wedged in there good. When I tried to turtle out, I noticed that uh, when I tried to yaw, you can use yaw in turtle mode, and it'll kind of give you a, you know, spin you around. And when I tried to do that, I could only yaw in one direction. That means two of my motors were completely stuck. I mean, I tried a lot of jiggling around, and Brian was hucking the basketball. He found a big stick to huck up there, a big heavy stick. But, oh, raindrops. Yeah, I was gonna say, it's gonna, it's looking more and more like rain. So we figured we should go home and get the PVC pipe. She doesn't know how to talk to both of us at the same time. Judy, I did a fantastic job. I was, uh, what was I doing? Some kind of, flippy do upside down switcheroo thing and I drifted up and back and I parked in the tree right into backed in real nice like you were uh, trying to get into the garage it was fantastic this is Brian hi I'm Brian he did a good job he was uh, throwing the basketball up there but it's too high we have to go home and get the, the 20 foot pole I think we're gonna need more than 20 feet. I don't know. We've reached it. We've gotten it out of that tree before. We got okay. Mike out of that tree, I think. 20 feet. I hope we don't need more. If we need more than 20 feet, we're not Mike. Mike couldn't get that high up in the tree. Mike's, <laughs> Mike's drone is what we got out of the tree. This is true. Though I don't know if you should be disparaging poor Mike's. Uh, well, I was just climb, saying, tree climbing skills. And we couldn't get them out is, is no, kind of what I was implying. That's true. Kind of, uh, I want to, well, we almost went in front of that guy. We Sorry. Would, we would have won. We would have won. We would I would have just floored it and got way up there. Get her to talk to me. Talk to me! Look at that, Judy. Judy, over here. Track my face. Oh, good Christ. Now what are you looking at? Hey Judy, how's it going? Did she get you? No, she did not. Oh, I got her to get me. Good job, Pat. Judy, you're too complicated. That's way up there in that tree, Pat. It's, uh, it's up there. Do you have a ladder? Yeah. I think we should bring the ladder and the stick. We can throw the stick, you know, you kind of yeah. give it a... I was hitting it with the ball. Yeah, you were. How high can you throw a basketball, Brian? How high? How high? What's the... Uh, I don't know. I don't think I've ever, like, measured it. <laughs> well, Generally have... speaking, the basketball hoop is 10 feet off the ground, so... That's true. I'm not a regulation basketball hoop. Oh, geez, I almost Did touched you your just... hand. <laughs> I just tried to grab my almost. hand in his car. I almost touched his hand. You touched my hand. I did touch it. It happened. It's getting darker. Yeah, we're gonna get wet, Judy. Use Judy as a selfie stick and put it up. We we <laughs> kill the Osmo trying to get the drone out, but would, it might be interesting. We would. I was gonna stand on top of your car and we could joust. You just drive Ooh. down, and I would aim as we get there. As yeah. we get close, I fling myself off the hood of your car. You'd never get hurt. You doing slam that. on the brakes. Not a chance. <laughs> slam on the. You'd go flying. It'd be fantastic. It would be, and the whole thing would be filmed from the pocket on the stick all the way up at the top of the tree. That'd be pretty good. You want to sacrifice yourself, Judy? Judy can't tell us. Would we get any? What would be the benefit of that video? Internet points. 
But I don't think it'd be worth the $350 and your hospital stay. Do you know what Tiburon means? No. Tiger. Tiger? I think so. It's very toyed, like a Tiburon. Yeah, you are. You buy a lot, I mean, not very much. I will. Have enough. Oh, well. I have been. We had them short in a desk for a short person. Which of your quadcopters is that up there in the tree, Pat? Ah, uh, that's the one that flies nice. That's my flow ride that's in good shape. Chris has the garage thing over there so she doesn't accidentally open the door. Can you see me, Judy? When she's parking out front. Oh, uh, okay. She's done that before. Don't tell YouTube. <laughs> Chris's secret is safe with me. <laughs> Judy, there's a, a truck and a trailer right in front of us. Just sitting here. They just swapped drivers. They did a fire drill. In the middle of... And now it's moving. I don't think we can call that that anymore, Pat. I can call it a fire drill. A fire drill? Just a fire drill. Okay. I should leave Judy recording while we do this. Oops. We should film Brian. Look at the size of these sticks. These are uh, three quarter inch or one, no, these are probably one inch. Are they one inch, do they say? This is the conflicting part, because uh, do you help Brian put the stick together? <laughs> Don't laugh at him, Judy. See, Judy, we can't glue these together because otherwise they don't go in the car. I do. I did the same thing the first time I brought it out. Once you get it in there, like a pool cue, though. Oh, geez. You guys can't see this, but he's inches away. <laughs> a little bit left. You gotta go a little left. Do it again. I'm not feeling it hitting anything. You're so close. We gotta get the ladder. You want me to try here? Let's uh. Taller. I'm not that. I can't get any. Well, maybe. I doubt it. How far off am I? Oh no. Oh, it's I can't. Right there. Yeah, I can't see it now anymore from sitting here. There, go. You hit it. Hey! hey look at that. It's down! We got you out, Judy. Good work, Brian. Good work, Pat. She didn't even break a prop. I won't be surprised if I broke uh, an ESC or something when we were trying to wiggle it out, though. Oh, that prop's busted. Yeah, that one's... 
He's seen better days. We're well, trying to. Judy, this means we're gonna get to uh, put the clip of me backing into that tree like an idiot into the video. Will it track your quadcopter? No, I don't think it's that fancy. You're quite terrible, Judy. Your props are next. How dangerous do you think this is, Judy? Uh, it could try to go to space with those props. It could. That'll make it interesting. We'll turtle mode it first. Judy, if you turtle mode, you can you can see if all four of your motors are actually spinning. And they, they seem to be. They do. I have no idea if it's in frame. Oh, it's fo trying to focus on it. Seems fine. We'll take it, Judy. Good job, Brian. I'm an excellent cinematographer. And it was just barely long enough. We got it out. Props are mangled, but she still hovers. I was kind of expecting that... Uh, Maybe one of those motors wasn't spinning when I was trying to yaw because I burned out an ESC up in the tree trying to wiggle out. You gotta be careful. ESCs burn out all the time when you're trying to wiggle out of a tree. But yeah, that's uh, working just fine. We got it out. It's hovering. I'll just put new props on. It'll be good as new. And I have the footage so you can see what a dumbass I am. Can you say dumbass on YouTube? I don't even know if you can, but I did. So... A lot of traffic coming, Judy. So I talked to you the whole way over here, and I found out I never actually hit record. She was here face tracking me the whole time. I figured that was fine. Didn't check to see that she was recording. She's recording now, so we're doing a good job. So the little updates: the three inches flying seemingly fine with the new filtering. I didn't uh, do any tuning or anything. I got stuck in a tree for a bit and bent a prop and she's a little, she's got a little bit of an oscillation at high throttle with that bent prop. I'm gonna have to fix that. So she's right on the edge of flying wrong if that slightly out of, out of straight prop is uh, goofing her up. I did not see any bobbles in the four inch today after putting the screws back onto the top of the flight controller. So that's, that's exciting to me. Got him stuck in a tree too. He's doing a... It was tough to see. When the sun went down, I still had the ND filter on. And I don't think it'd matter whether I had the ND filter on or not. When it's cloudy and gloomy, it's really hard to see anything out of the FPV feed of the turtle. Maybe you can tweak the settings a bit. and Maybe it'd record well and give you a good FPV feed. But I don't really want to do it. Oh, we got a red light, Judy. When you get a red light, you turn on red. That's the uh, that's what you do. Oh, and they don't have a green light, so we get to go. How about that? Pretty awesome. We brought the ladder, the 17-foot uh, magic folding miraculous ladder. I don't know what they're called. And I think it's a knockoff from Harbor Freight. But I hurt my back a little trying to finagle it into the back seat. It didn't want to fit. I'll be fine. Don't worry. You shouldn't be worried. Man, look at how sunny it is this way. I can't tell you why we don't park in the driveway because I'll get in trouble on YouTube. But we have a fairly steep uh, driveway. It's a little bit narrow back here. Somebody doesn't like it. I don't mind. It's fine. So it would be nice if the driveway was good, uh, maybe five feet wider. It would be easier to park two cars back here. But it's tough to get an angle to fit two cars. Can we get a little closer? Should we get closer, Judy? There we go. How's that? You can't tell. You have no idea. But it's fine. Judy can't see me. Judy! There she goes. 
So anyway, I'm going to go inside. Uh, if you like what I'm up to, just uh, I'd love it if you'd uh, like the video and subscribe to the channel, comment, go check out my blogs about the three inch micro frame I'm, I've been designing. I really need to start manufacturing that. I think it's about ready. But uh, yeah, I'm going to go inside. Have a good day.